The overall goal of the following experiment is to use the Vertical Diffusion Chamber, or VDC model, to investigate bacterial interactions with and invasion of intestinal epithelial cells. This is achieved first by using a special filter seeded with a polarized monolayer of CACO2 intestinal epithelial cells to create separate apical and basal lateral compartments in the VDC. In the second step, the bacterial inoculum of interest is added to the apical compartment under microaerobic conditions, and cell culture medium is added to the basolateral compartment under aerobic conditions. Then, at the desired time points during the co-culture, the filter is removed and the numbers of interacting or intracellular bacteria are enumerated. Ultimately, an increase in the number of interacting and intracellular bacteria can be observed using the VDC model compared to standard aerobic culture conditions. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods, such as the standard tissue culture adhesion and invasion assays, is that with this technique, the co-culture of bacteria and intestinal epithelial cells is performed under in vitro conditions that more closely mimic the in vivo conditions of the human intestine. Demonstrating the procedure will be Navida Naz, a PhD student from my laboratory, and Dominic Mills, a postdoc who developed the vertical diffusion chamber model as part of his PhD in my laboratory. Begin by seeding 4 by 10 to the 5th CACO2 intestinal epithelial cells per 0.4 micron filter in culture medium. Then